Hi, welcome back to Diesel Dave's YouTube channel. This is an update and show you the progress we're on our layout at the moment and for the new changes that we've been doing and the things we're actually working on. As you see now, I've got the electrics up the top now, ready for our next platform as this area is going to start going up in the air. Looking forward to this, so I'm hoping to do this in two or three weeks' time. What I've done in the meantime, I've actually put the entrance on now. Got that in position, so it shows you how we're going to go up. So once this area goes up, it just gives another floor. I've got the uh, tarmac done over the back now to blend in well. I put the new fence, and I've got the new car park area all lined up, ready to go. This is good stuff. It's like PC duct tape adhesive strips, sheets, and you just put them down. This is quite nice to work on because if you start put doing markings on roads and bits and pieces, it's ideal to do. So it saves a lot of hassle and a lot of time. As you've got the platform in the front here at the moment, this is painted up. I've just got to decorate it with some bits and pieces. You've got the 416 sitting in there at the moment, gives you some idea. And plus the class 24 parked up. I've done away with the actual um, banking here at the moment because I want to come up with something different. So in the meantime, I've just cleaned up the track, got rid of all the ballast, and this is all ready to go. So there's plenty of room to work down here, plenty of stuff to do. So this is what I'm hoping to do in two or three next week's time. So look out and stay tuned for that. As we're coming up the lane now, very happy with this now. I'm going to start putting some of this to bed now, actually, and start working on it. Just give you some idea. I keep coming up here, and I'm still the same, so it's nice to change and get it finished. Right over the back here, we start. They've started painting the beard or woodings, but it looks like the paint and decorators are off at the moment. It looks like they're off to the calf. Done a bit of work, so I'm hoping they will finish that in the next couple of weeks, so they'll come up a treat. As you come along here, you've got the M&D bus parked up. Looks like it's coming for service, and it looks like you've got Del Boy popping in to see if the paint and decorators are working. But he's going to get no luck in that. So, like I say, I hope to get that sorted in the next couple of weeks. It depends how quick they work. As you come down here in the front, we've had a little change in the scrap yard at the moment, moving things around, trying different things. But I think we're starting to get there now. A lot of people like the old scrap yard. So much going on and such a little bit of space. So it's really good. Same to get your teeth in. I've actually ordered the barbed wire now, so we should see that go on in a couple of weeks' time. As you come over here, my wife has got some more bits and pieces to go into the garden area and these cottages. Uh, still not on there at the moment, but what she's done is come up quite impressive. A lot of people actually like what she's done, and a lot of nice thumbs up on that one. So I hope you're sharing that one, and show you what you can do with your imagination. And a lot of it say it's just recycle, like matchsticks and rock waste that we chuck away. So it gives you something to save a bit of money. Like you think, most of the kit that you see around in this layer is only made out of polystyrene and bits of rubbish that we chuck away. And, you know, a bit of time and a bit of imagination is surprising what you can come up with. So I say I hope you like what you see and subscribe to my channel and like and share it and follow me on this journey. Like I say, we've come a long way now. This is number videos, number 51 now. So if you look from my journey from the beginning and how much we progress, you'll be quite surprised. We've had some nice comments, so I've put a few shouts out to people that helped me along the line. So, you know, things are starting to progress now, so I'm looking forward to doing the next stage. Like I say, there's plenty of change going on, so stay tuned, and this is Diesel Dave saying goodbye.